Education Department on Gadget Drive. Abuka SDA builds up the temple even as they build up the kingdom. Welcome to the NJC Focus. I'm Pastor Jeremy Johnson. The details after the break. Stay tuned. This is Ted Wilson and uh, Pastor Wilson and you are watching NJC Focus. Stay tuned. Welcome back and now for the details. As the continuation of the pandemic drives classes online, the Sendons Bay High Preparatory and the Falmouth SDA Preparatory Schools continue to deliver using technology. It is against this background that the Department of Education in the North Jamaica Conference is on a drive to supply the schools with well-needed gadgets to ensure that the teacher learning experience can take place online. Just this week, several devices, including tablets, webcams, and microphones, were distributed to the schools to assist teachers, even as they reach our students. And the department continues to invite persons and board to assist as we seek to supply more of our young people with devices so that they too can access online classes. Let's take a look. Okay, Pastor, we do appreciate this gesture from North Jamaica Conference of Seventh-day Adventists, especially the education department. These are well-needed gadgets. Uh, our teachers are so much in need of them. It's not quite the amount that um, can take care of the, the need, but however, we're looking forward to doing a better job at online with these gadgets that you have um, donated to us and we do appreciate it and we want to say many thanks. Should you desire to donate a device to assist us as we continue to offer Adventist Christian education, please feel free to reach out to us so that we can make the arrangements. You may email us at education at njcadventist.org or send us a message at 876-850-9119 on WhatsApp. We look forward to you partnering with us even as we narrow the technological divide so that online learning can take place even as we battle the pandemic. A special thanks to all those who have already donated towards this initiative. You are watching NJC Focus. Stay tuned. The Seventh-day Adventist Church Abuka in the Wild King District of Churches in St. Anne is on a mission to build up the temple even as they build up the kingdom of God. Just last Sabbath, NJC Focus caught up with the brethren who were in high spirits as they worshipped in their beautiful edifice, which is a mission center to spread the good news of God all around the communities in their vicinity. Let us take a look. He himself was and is the message, mm. not his teachings, but himself, righteousness in Christ. Amen. God's mission was to rebuild the temple. Yes. What is the purpose of the sanctuary? Let them make me a sanctuary that I may dwell among them. God wants a sanctuary in every community so that he can dwell in the world. Yes. But instead of building a temple, they brought the beauty of holiness into this repute by leaving God's house in bushes. Something that God does not like. True. Oh my God. Jesus said it is a foolish man All right. who starts to build a house Come on. and cannot finish it. Yes. Many never liked what was going on because some people take pleasure in your failure. Yes. yes, sir. But the people kept on persevering, understanding that if God brings you to it, He can take you through it. Yes. I never heard the preacher. The Aboka SDA Church is led by Pastor Christoph Hyman. Continue to pray for the brethren, even as they fulfill the divine mandate to advance the kingdom of God. Happy Sabbath from Aboka. We are just open and trusting that we all stay close to Jesus until He comes. So that when he comes, none of us will be running away from him. But we all hail him as our Lord and Savior from sin. God bless you.
Amen. And come this Sunday, September 26, North Jamaica Conference invites the leaders from across the field to join it for its Virtual Leaders Council. The program will be held on Zoom and starts at 10 a.m. You may contact your local pastor for the connecting information. On each episode of the NJC Focus, we bring you NJC obituaries, celebrating the saints who have passed in North Jamaica Conference. Let us look at the latest. Let's keep these families in our prayers, even as they go through this difficult time of mourning. And as we anticipate the blessed hope, let us remain faithful to God, that by His grace, we will all be reunited with our loved ones in the Lord. You are watching NJC Focus. Stay tuned. And there are some important announcements for you to bear in mind. And that's it for the latest edition of the NJC Focus. Remember to let us know what's happening in your neck of the woods by submitting your ministry media by Wednesday of each week so that we can highlight them right here. Join us this evening on NCU TV as well as tomorrow morning for a rebroadcast. And then next week, same place, same time, for another episode of the NJC Focus. And until then, happy Sabbath.